Assalamu alaikum everyone. We're looking at another question here, exam question. Let's get started. So here is a sketch of a curve. The equation of the curve is in the form y equals x squared plus ax plus b, where a and b are integers. The points 0 minus 5 and 5 0 lie on the curve. Now before I proceed any further, this point is where the graph touches the y-axis because the x-coordinate is 0. As soon as you see the x-coordinate is 0 on a particular graph, that's your y-intercept, right? That's where your graph is touching the y-axis, right? So that's 0 minus 5. And similarly, whenever you see the y-coordinate is 0, that's where the graph is touching the x-axis. So 5, 0 has to be on the right hand side. So that's going to be this point here, 5, 0. It can't be the one on the, it cannot be this one over here because on this side, the x coordinate is going to be negative. So I know that this is 5, 0 and 0 minus 5. Now, if I look at the question, it's asking for the coordinates of the turning point of the curve, which is somewhere here. So let's uh, look at this, right? y equals ax squared sorry let me rewrite that it's not ax squared it's x squared plus ax plus b so let's start off with when the x coordinate is 0 and y is minus 5 I want to substitute these values in so y is going to be minus 5, then x is going to be 0 squared plus a times 0 plus b. So 0 squared is 0, a times 0 is 0, so I'm left with b on its own, and b is minus 5. So now I can rewrite my equation as y is equal to x squared plus ax minus 5. Now I'm going to use the second coordinate over here, second pair of coordinates. So when x is 5 and y is 0. So we've got 0 is equal to 5 squared plus a times 5 minus 5. 5 squared is 25 plus 5a minus 5 and since 25 and uh, f minus 5 are like terms you can simplify that to give me 20 so I've got 20 plus 5a is equal to 0 so I subtract 20 both sides just gonna move that here so I've got minus 20 is equal to 5a and I divide both sides by 5 give me a equals minus 4 so once that's done over here in blue I'm going to rewrite my equation so y is equal to x squared minus 4x because the value of a is minus 4 and b is minus 5 now to find the turning point I need to complete the square so I'm gonna start off by halving the coefficient over here of x so that's x minus 2 whole squared minus the square of this number here so minus 2 whole squared minus 5 which is x minus 2 whole squared minus 4 minus 5 which is x minus 2 whole squared minus 9 So to find the turning point, I need to get the x value for which this bracket is going to be 0. And that x value is going to be 2. So 2 minus 2 will be 0. So when x is equal to 2, y would be minus 9. And you'll see how. So 2 minus 2 is e squared minus 9. That will be 0 minus 9, which is minus 9. So your turning point here is going to be 2 minus 9. 
That's the answer to this question. Thank you for watching.